if you ever see a cage like this. It's known as a mort safe. And these were placed here for a very specific and rather horrible reason. You see, it, by the 19th century, as medical schools began to get more advanced and began to really study the human anatomy, there was a, a growing need for cadavers that could be used in medical schools to teach the students the human anatomy. Well, typically, Cadavers could only be provided by the deceased remains of executed criminals. Well, that wasn't nearly enough to meet the demand. And so a very uh, thriving body snatching industry began uh, in places like Edinburgh, where there was a medical school. It was a lucrative business and people could make a lot of money doing it. And so there grew a fear of having your body taken and dissected in a medical school. And so places like the Greyfriars Kirkyard began to provide mort safes, even ones that were temporary where the body could be held until it, it had decayed sufficiently where it was no longer in demand, so to speak. Uh, one of the most well-known cases of body snatching uh, involves men by the name of Burke and Hare. There have actually been movies made about them where they realized that there was even more money to be made if you didn't wait for the people to actually die. And they started actually killing people uh, and selling their bodies uh, to medical schools to make a quick buck. Well, one of them eventually turned on the other. Uh, the one that did not turn first got executed and he himself actually became a donation to a medical school.